Today I'm going to show you how you can install and use timestamps on your videos just like this example here. And it's actually really useful for longer videos because you're no longer clicking about looking for information because it's already labelled for you. So as you can see this video does not have any timestamps at the moment but we need to add them. And to do this you want to make sure you're signed into your correct YouTube channel and then you want to go to the back end of that video using YouTube Studio. So once you're in YouTube Studio and you're on the video editor, you want to make sure you're on the details tab for the correct video you want to edit. Now in order to add the chapters to your video, it's actually very simple. You want to go to the description of your video and all you need to do is just write up some timestamps and that is it. So I'm going to paste some timestamps here that I've already created for that video. So all you need to do is type in the timestamp that you want to add and then next to it you just want to label it just in this format as you see right here. Now each timestamp has to be at least 10 seconds long and the first timestamp needs to start at 00, zero just so YouTube knows where to start and how to format the timestamps. Now this is just an example but you can make your timestamps look a lot prettier by giving it its own section of the video just so it's easier for viewers to find and use. However, they're going to be using the chapters on the video, so they shouldn't need to use this anyway. So once you've added your timestamps, you want to click on save just at the top here. And as soon as your video has saved, you want to go back to it by clicking on the thumbnail just to the left. So if you have done that correctly, you should see the timestamps on the video, or shall I say the chapters, just on the time bar here. And if you go to the description of the video, you should also notice the timestamps are here as well. So for whatever reason you don't want to use the chapters, you can just use the timestamps at the bottom here. And that is all you need to do to add chapters to your YouTube videos. And I'm going to be adding them to this video as well, just as another example so you can see them. So if this video was helpful, please leave a like and pass it on to someone who may find it helpful as well. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. Thank you for watching and have a good day.